In this tutorial, I'll show you how to update Google Sheets with a Google Service Account in the Google Sheets API in Python. So a service account is a special type of account used by Google Cloud Service, such as Vision AI, Cloud Storage, Text-to-Speech, and many other services. When you are using a Google Sheets API to update a Google Sheets, Google Sheets API requires you to verify your account or user's account via OAuth2 protocol if you are hosting your script on the cloud, then it's almost impossible for the app or for the program to self-authenticate. And that's where a service account comes in handy. By using a service account, we'll be able to bypass the OAuth 2 authentication step. Now let's look at the agenda for uh, this video. Right, so I'll show you a couple of things. I'm going to show you how to create a brand new service account. Then we'll download the required Python package. And lastly, I'll show you an example on how to uh, write a Python script to connect to Google Sheets API and make an update. All right, so I'm going to uh, navigate to console.cloud.google.com. On the dashboard, uh, pick your project that you want to use. Next, click on navigation menu. APIs and services, then click on credentials. On the top, I'm going to click on create credentials. And here we have three options. Click on service account. I'm going to name my account JJ testing. Then click on create and continue. And here we want to choose a road uh, to assign to this account. And for demonstration purpose, I'm going to choose the owner permission. And click on continue. On this step, I'm going to leave these two fields blank. Then click on done to create the service account. All right, so here's the JJ testing account that I just created. Now click on the account. On the top, you want to click on keys. And here I want to add a new set of key. I'm going to save the key as a JSON file. I'm going to name the file service account underscore JJ and save the file. Now I want to go back to uh, my service account summary page. All right, so here I'm going to grab uh, the account email address. Uh, should be this one. And I'll copy the email address somewhere. I'll copy the email address to my uh, Python script. So basically, this email address uh, is your email address. Except that you don't have an actual platform to uh, access this account, but you do have access uh, to manage this account. And how I'm going to uh, use this account to bypass the authentication is by providing this service account file. So here we have this uh, client email address, in which should be the same as uh, this email address. Sure, I think they are a little bit different. Let me just double check. So they are the same. All right, so I'm going to grab the email address. And let's say I want to uh, modify this Google Sheets. And right now this Google Sheets is under my data dummy account at gmail.com, uh, this account. So what we need to do here is we need to share uh, the spreadsheet to the service account. And for the permission setting, make sure that you assign editor permission to the service account. And click on share. Now this email address has full permission to manage this Google Sheets file. All right, so we have done uh, item one, two, and three. And I'll post the information uh, in the description below. 
Right, so the last item is going to be uh, writing the Python script. So from the import statement, I'm going to type import Google dot OAuth two, and from OAuth two module, I'm going to import the service account module, and this will be from NX from Google API client dot discovery i'm going to import the build function so here i'm going to create a variable called service account file and this variable is going to point to the service account uh, json file that was downloaded and from the service account module i want to reference the credentials class that from service account file I'm going to use this function to load the client file to authenticate the account. So we're going to uh, specify the parameter name and I'll assign the service account file path. And I'll name the output's credentials. Now we're ready to construct the Google service instance. So I'm going to insert the build function. We need to provide the API name that I want to use, and it's going to be sheets, the API version, and to authenticate the account from credentials parameter, I'm going to supply the credentials object. I'll name the output service sheets. And here I'm going to print the service sheets object. Now, if I run the script, if I don't run into any error, so let me activate my environment first. And when I execute the script, it was able to uh, print the object just fine. And that means we have successfully connected to the Google Sheets uh, service. And to make an update to uh, this spreadsheet, and let's say I want to insert a new transaction to this line here. So I'm going to grab this code block and I'll copy and paste to my script. So here's Google Sheets ID. The cell range that I want to uh, insert the value and it's going to be B6 to E6. The values that I want to enter and this line is going to perform the operation. All right, so here I'm going to help me do this. I'm going to run the Python script. So here I have an error. Let me take a look. And this should be service underscore sheets. Let me try again. And if you look at the spreadsheets, and here's the new entry created by the service account without using my own credential and while going to the OAuth 2 uh, protocol process. All right, so this is going to be everything I'm going to share in this video and hopefully you guys found this video useful. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.